Let's speak to the guys from Imperial. We've got Fallen standing by for the winner's interview. Let's see if we can hear us all okay. Hello, guys. Yeah, I can hear you. Hello, Hello. Fallen. First of all, congratulations on making it through. I want to ask, how does it feel for you? Because obviously you've been in this position many times before, but obviously a brand new lineup coming through. We're talking about this last dance. Do you still get that excitement and that, that want from all of this? Uh, it was very nice. It's an amazing feeling. It's a little bit of a relief as well. You know, <laughs> it's a lot of tension when you are building up for a qualification process like that. Uh, the team has been working very hard for the last two months. And of course, a very new team. But the expectation to read the major is always there for everyone. Doesn't matter if it's your first time, if it's your 12th time like mine. You always want to be there. So yeah, it was very, very nice to qualify here. Fallen, I'm not going to lie, uh, myself and, and a lot of people doubted that you guys were ready already to, to qualify for the Major. How does how good sorry, does it feel to, to prove me and, and I guess everyone else out there in the community wrong that, that you still have it, that you're still good enough? Uh, I mean, I know that the players I have, I'm playing with, they are they play a very high level of CS. Mm -hmm. And you know, when, when you get the right players in a good atmosphere, you can go very far for team. It's very early stage to say how, how far we can go. But honestly, it's a very good start. Uh, we're planning to participate in the Brazilian Major. That's our main goal with this team. We want to be there with our crowd. We want to sure. be playing this uh, second Major of the year. And to be able to participate in the first one right away, it's it's something magical. So uh, I'm, I'm just happy that we're happy to prove some people wrong. Yeah, Yeah, and, and I'm curious, Fallen, right? Because you know your team better than we would ever do. You practice with them every day. What you've shown here at this AMA, was that the, the best level we've seen yet from Imperial? Or do you still think there's there's more to come? Yeah, honestly, yeah, we can play much better. Uh, mm -hmm. Even this game, for example, when you, when you play teams uh, like uh, Part Astronauts, it's not about how, how deep your book is, it's not about how deep their book is, because it's very simplistic CS. Yeah. And I, I was listening to you guys before this interview started. If you want to complicate too much and go too deep on the on the thoughts uh, about the game, it can, it can be even be worse for us, you know? So that's mm -hmm. why we just play a little bit of a basic CS here at the very end. That's why we needed to win the game. And even in, I, I think the team has to grow a lot. Even if we have a lot of experienced players, uh, we still have to learn a lot of things. There's a couple of basics that a lot of FPL players would be doing better than us at the moment. But there's a lot of things that we know better than them as well mm -hmm. because of our experience. So it's, it's up to us to work hard and, and be humble to, to know that some stuff changed, some stuff are faster than we think, and some gaps on the map people are capitalizing on them. And we, as much as we keep playing, then we're going to learn those things because a little bit of CS is a little bit different from the past, and we've got to keep. Uh, working on it. What's uh, what's next for you guys? Like going to the major? Uh, do you plan to boot camp in Europe? Are you going home? How, how, how are you going to prepare for the for the biggest tournament so far? Uh, this year has been very crazy. Every time we schedule ourselves to do something, uh, there's a new tournament or Valve changed the rule <laughs> that you're supposed to play in your country and then you change everything. Like a lot of things that we plan when it's time to go, it's, things just change. So we're supposed to go back to North America right now, but then a Brazilian spot to play one tournament uh, in North America in the future showed up and we have been invited to a Brazilian qualification. So we're going to have to go back to Brazil to play this tournament. And after that, uh, we're going to come back to another seven to 10 days boot camp before the major starts. Okay, great. And Fallen, one last thing from me, before you get to the major, right, to bring yourselves up even further, what kind of things do you think is missing right now for Imperial to give yourself a good chance going up into the major? Uh, I mean, I think uh, we, we need to win our matches. A lot of a lot of guys haven't been playing for a long time. I think less. Let's major that both played was 2017. Let's major that FMX player was 2016. You know, so some of those guys they're they're scrapping out their game and they're getting used to it. I have to learn and grow a lot as an opera as well. I'm, I'm trying to to be the best version I can. It's been a little bit tough uh, at his age. It's been a little bit tough after having a big career, but I'm working the best I can. And very proud of Fur and Vini. I think those guys are they are our biggest shooters. You know, it's, it's it's great to have them on the team. I think they're playing superb CS. Everyone is uh, peacemaker is helping us a lot with the calls and and working on what the team needs, right? Because conversation about coach is always the same. Uh, there there isn't just one way to be coaching a team. You kind of have to adjust yourself and, and find the best way your team needs you. And I think we have been working well with Peacemaker on learning how we can work better together. It's been great so far. So if the team needs more time for sure, and we got to keep grinding just like we are. Well, I wish you the best of luck doing so. Fulham, thank you very much for your time, man. We'll speak to you next time. Appreciate guys. Thank you very much. Valeu, Brasil. Tamo junto. É nóis. Lovely stuff there. And like you said about the experience, I'm helping him out for sure when it comes to some of these games. But all in all, fairly positive and also very honest with his answers. Yeah. yeah.